from the Bob Mills Weather Center, meteorologist Aaron Reeves. Well, thanks to cloud cover, things have been once again cool today. That along with a lot of cool air advection, thanks to northerly winds that have been blustery. 50s across Kansas, upper 50s to low 60s across Oklahoma, 60s and 70s down into Texas. We're going to see some improving weather, though, as we roll into tomorrow afternoon. But we do got a couple of chilly mornings ahead of us. You can see these shaded counties. Those are frost and freeze advisories. Clouds hanging tough for now. We've at times seen some drizzle in this, mainly this morning. Uh, and a couple of breaks here and there, but all in all, it has been cloudy, it has been breezy, and it has been cool. All thanks to this big upper level low that's uh, kind of over the Great Lakes. We've been on the back side of that. This is going to continue to move eastward, and over time, we're going to get a little bit of influence from this ridge. It is going to help our temperatures warm up just a bit. We do have one quick moving system that will be passing to our north on Wednesday. Not going to have a whole lot to work with. Uh, as far as providing rain and storms on a widespread basis. I mean, there's a like five to 10% chance, but uh, those chances not looking very impressive. And then as we head toward the end of the week, once again, not much change there. A little bit of a northwesterly flow aloft. This ridge starts to at least be close enough to warm our temperatures up just a little bit. We'll be in the, the above normal category during that time frame, but not much. I mean, we're going to we're going to typically expect temperatures this time of year to be in the low 70s. We're going to be mid to upper 70s, so uh, it'll be pretty nice. It's going to be a nice week. Chilly starts Monday and Tuesday morning, but those will be followed by really, really nice afternoons. And as we take a look at rain chances, once again, I don't have a whole lot for you there. Wednesday, just a slim chance as that front passes. Uh, and then another chance early next week, but all in all, those chances very, very low. We have been socked in with clouds all day long. Still a lot of people out and about here at the gathering place. 59 right now, northwest breeze at 16, adding a chill to the air. The dew point at 39, so drier air has moved into the area, and that will allow temperatures to be cool tonight. Where clouds are in place, we're in the upper 50s to around 60, out west of I-35, where there really isn't much in the way of cloud cover temperatures right now in the lower 60s. We'll keep the north winds overnight, but they will relax just a little bit. We'll wake up chilly. Look at this, upper 30s to low 40s, even colder out to the west. Uh, and then as we roll into the Monday afternoon, light winds, sunshine, and highs that will be topping out in the mid 60s. So really, this is going to be pretty nice. Five to 10 mile per hour winds, sunny skies, 60s. I mean, that's going to be a pretty good day. We'll start off chilly on Tuesday morning. Could be some frost north of Tulsa, but we'll rebound nicely with south winds returning into the lower 70s. Wednesday, that front approaches and moves through, but notice not developing a whole lot in the way of rain along that we will still be well into the 70s and then Thursday behind that system. We'll see a few clouds, but notice not a big cool down. Those temperatures still well into the 70s. Friday we clear out. We stay in the 70s. This is basically why October is like my favorite month. I like the 70s and I mean, it's just a good month. Unfortunately, it's followed by my least favorite time of year, which is winter, not too far thereafter. Uh, we do see rain totals. Once again, not much of a chance over the next seven days. So uh, obviously the totals aren't very prevalent on our prediction there. And as we take a look at tomorrow, some clouds in the morning, a chilly start. We warm up nicely into the 60s during the afternoon with a northwest breeze. It's going to be an a OK day for us once we get to the afternoon time frame, and then we'll get into the 70s there on out through the rest of the week with some clouds here and there. Really, really nice weather. Lows in the 50s, highs generally into the 70s and chances of rain. Unfortunately, because we need rain, are pretty low all the way around. That's your forecast. Let's send it on over to sports.